Hello everyone and welcome aboard. Today, we're embarking on an incredible journey beneath the waves as we explore how submarines, these titans of the deep, manage to traverse the world's most tumultuous waters with remarkable ease. What makes these vessels so stable and efficient in conditions that would toss any ordinary boat around? Let's dive in and uncover the secrets behind the incredible engineering of submarines. The Marvel of Engineering Submarines are a testament to human ingenuity in the realms of maritime engineering. Designed to be stealthy and efficient, their sleek, streamlined shape enables them to glide through water with minimal resistance. This design philosophy is akin to the aerodynamics of an airplane, but adapted for the dense medium of water. Just as an airplane's shape is crucial for flight, the submarine's contours are vital for underwater navigation. In terms of materials, submarines are built from high-strength, specialized alloys that can withstand extreme underwater pressures, further enhancing their streamlined design. These materials are not only strong, but also lightweight relative to their strength, contributing to the overall hydrodynamic efficiency of the vessel. Their rounded bodies and tapered ends reduce drag significantly, allowing submarines to move more swiftly and silently than other underwater vehicles. This design minimizes noise and vibration, which is crucial for military subs that rely on stealth. By mimicking the natural shapes found in marine life, such as dolphins and sharks, engineers have created vessels that can maneuver through the water with incredible grace and speed. Stability secrets revealed. The core of a submarine's ability to maintain stability lies in its meticulously calculated center of gravity. This is strategically placed as low as possible within the submarine's structure. By positioning heavy equipment like engines and batteries near the bottom, submarines achieve a natural ballast that keeps them upright and stable, even in rough underwater currents. Another key aspect of their stability is the distribution of mass within the submarine. Equipment and supplies are arranged to ensure that weight is evenly distributed from bow to stern, which helps maintain balance. This careful arrangement prevents the submarine from rolling and pitching excessively, which could compromise maneuverability and safety. Furthermore, the submarine's design includes ballast tanks, which are crucial for adjusting the vessel's buoyancy. These tanks can be filled with water to increase weight for submerging, or air can be pumped in to replace the water when it's tied to surface. This ability to adjust buoyancy on demand is fundamental to maintaining stability under various operational conditions. The ballast and trim systems. Submarines' best kept secrets. The ballast system in a submarine is akin to the balancing act of a tightrope walker. It's all about precision and control. The system includes several tanks spread throughout the vessel, which can be filled with water or air to adjust the submarine's weight and buoyancy. This setup allows the submarine to maintain or alter its depth in the water smoothly. The trim system works in tandem with the ballast system to fine-tune the submarine's stability and orientation. It adjusts the water within the trim tanks to ensure the sub is perfectly horizontal in the water. This is crucial for operations requiring precision and stealth, such as scientific measurements or military surveillance. Managing these systems requires a deep understanding of fluid dynamics and physics, and it's a skill that submariner crews perfect over years of training. The correct use of ballast and trim systems not only ensures the submarine's efficient operation, but also enhances safety by preventing unintended rises or drops in depth. The art of diving and surfacing. Diving is an art form in submarine operations. The process involves a careful increase in weight by filling the ballast tanks with water, allowing the submarine to descend gracefully into the deeper layers of the ocean. This maneuver must be executed with precision to avoid abrupt changes in depth, which could destabilize the sub. Surfacing, however, requires the exact opposite procedure. Here, the water in the ballast tanks is replaced with air, lightening the submarine so it can rise towards the surface. This process is equally delicate, as too rapid a rise can lead to decompression issues for both the submarine and its crew, akin to the bends experienced by divers. Both diving and surfacing are coordinated with meticulous attention to the submarine's balance and external conditions.
the crew must monitor sea conditions, internal pressure, and stability metrics closely, adjusting their approach as needed. This high level of control is crucial for the safety of the operations and the effectiveness of the submarine's performance. Training the masters of the deep, submarine crews undergo rigorous training to master the complex technologies and procedures required to operate these vessels. This training covers everything from the basics of submarine physics to advanced operational tactics. Crews spend months in simulators and training vessels, learning how to handle various underwater scenarios. Emergency training is also a critical component of their education. Crew members must be prepared to respond to power failures, breaches in the submarine's hull, and other potentially life-threatening situations. They practice drills regularly to ensure that their responses become second nature. Moreover, submariners are taught the importance of psychological resilience. Life aboard a submarine can be challenging due to the confined spaces, limited privacy and extended periods away from the surface. Mental toughness and team cohesion are therefore emphasized throughout their training, ensuring that crews can operate effectively under pressure. In today's deep dive, we've explored the complex interplay of engineering, physics, and human skill that allows submarines to operate with such remarkable stability and efficiency. These vessels are more than just modes of transport. They are finely tuned instruments of exploration and defense, navigating the ocean's depths with precision and grace. I hope you found this journey into the world of submarines as intriguing as I did. Have you ever wondered what it's like to be aboard one of these engineering marvels? Share your thoughts and questions in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated on our latest explorations. Thanks for watching, and dive deep into our next adventure.